Hi everyone, welcome back to Rocksteady. This is Tracy. I've got a little update for you on the end of the road. <clears throat> so um, I'll just let this lorry go by. I'm going to pause it for a sec. I've come inside just for a little bit because there's another one coming, but um, I just wanted to update you really because there are many, many, many tipper trucks going up and down the road with massive loads of clay filling it all in. So I know somebody complained before and it all had to stop and the council made everybody all work stop or prosecution but now it looks like it's all systems go and um, they were even flattening the road a little bit earlier which is a godsend. Now I've just noticed that one of my neighbours is coming so I was going to go for a walk down the end but I know she'll keep me talking for a little while so I'll pause it and um, come back to you uh, once I can get going again. All systems go clear but as you can see it is churning up the road a little bit but they were um, filling in some of these giant holes here because this used to be a really bad part but unfortunately by clearing it up just means that people will drive faster because that was the only thing used to stop them thundering along but as you can see it's quite muddy there's still a tipper truck down the end I'll try and zoom I can't find my microphone so hopefully it's not too um, too much wind noise there's very little wind that I can see so hopefully not but he's just kind of tipping it out we had a, um, a crane lorry sorry um, not a crane what am I trying to think of uh, yeah I guess it is a grabber you know like the giant version of the one you get at the seaside we had one of them there earlier just tipping it over but um, all the barriers are gone at the moment while they're working it's all exciting stuff so I'm gonna unzoom it because it's um, difficult to keep it in focus while I'm walking so I've just got to walk down the end of the road it's gonna get noisy when I get down there but they're just tipping it over the wow they're just tipping it out all over the um, you see it I just saw loads of it tipping out but I think I missed that part not that it's that exciting I know <clears throat> but yeah excellent stuff oh and I miss more tipping out typical but isn't it brilliant that they're actually resuming work? I spoke to the chap who was driving the lorry and he said that there's a guy coming up and down in a white van here and there. And if I talk to him, then he can give me an update. So hopefully, <coughs> hopefully I'll get an update. You never know. But um, whoever complained, I hope they, um, you know, they realise that it may be a bit muddy and it may be a bit of a, a noise and it may be, <coughs> excuse me, still got a bit of asthma this morning. Um, it may be a bit inconvenient, but in the long run, it's going to benefit us because if it stops the erosion, well, I don't think anything stops that eventual erosion, but if it, if it slopes it, if we can get down on the beach, if all those things, surely... It's got to be a bonus. Now I'm going to have to pause because this very noisy lorry is coming by. So um, bear with me one sec. So I was just talking to that chappy there that's um, just disappeared. And he was saying that, that, yeah, they're going to be working and doing all this. And you can see there's hardcore and there's earth. And at the moment they're just um, doing all this because this house here on the corner... Uh, doing it for him because his garden will fall otherwise but they are eventually going to do the slope all the way down so isn't that just amazing news i have to keep my eyes open in case i don't get squashed by a, a dumper truck <clears throat> but we'll come down and have a little look see what else we can see well look there's an opening <clears throat> Can I just go down there? Um, you, I'd rather you not, love, just in case. I know, but what if I just film a bit and come back? I'd rather you not, <laughs> just in case. No, I don't think anything will happen to me. If you go as far as them bricks. Yep, yeah, I'll go as far as them bricks. Thank you very much. Um, oh, on the other hand, no, I'd rather you not, just in case. Well, just, just, I'll just go there and straight back. Won't be a minute. Everybody, tipper trucks have been here. 
so I don't think I'm at any risk but we'll see so yeah this part of the road I've not been and seen I've not been down here since the cliff collapse and all that you can see where the house was look there's the garden honestly so much of it fell isn't that unbelievable you just forget hang on let me unzoom it, just, it looks like a long way away from me but it isn't but look at that just, you just can't fathom how much of it fell because that wow that is incredible can't see it from the other side but if i if i come over here hopefully you can see they're just filling see all those that tree line down there was up here <clears throat> there was a road if you look at my old videos on crochet rocks you'll see just how much fell but look wow if i come over here you can see this area here was part of that person's house but you can see now how much they're filling in they've fenced it all and um hopefully this area here then will be a slope soon we'll be able to get down there so that'd be great anyway i'm going to pause it and go back well that was very nice of him and um he just spoke to me and i was we were talking about just how much had actually fallen it's really unbelievable and it does bring it home to you but he's the man who drives the digger so that's what he's he's doing now he's coming along with his digger and he's gonna get rid of all that and put it over is that amazing wow all i'm gonna say is i am absolutely over the moon that they're doing this again because you know how stupid was it to stop it well so yeah i'm off back home in the warm up this muddy um i've got my old walking boots on i managed to find those i don't have any wellies i ordered some but somehow i don't think they're coming i have to reorder some i suppose but yeah how about that isn't that brilliant it does look a bit of a a muddy mess but to be honest with you this road does every year <laughs> looks like a muddy mess you know it's just the nature of living on the unmade road that leads to the edge of a cliff <clears throat> so as i mentioned i've been suffering with some asthma today woke up with it and uh been sorting out things and putting up shelving and going into the sort of corners of rooms that might be a bit dusty which has aggravated it a bit so as this is a hill as you can see I've got to walk up it I'm going to start wheezing in a minute so I'm going to end this now but thank you for watching and uh wow I just can't believe this started again I was so disappointed when they had to stop so thanks for watching bye for now take care everyone and stay safe